Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to disable the Windows 10 login password so you can log into your computer without needing to insert your password every time. Please keep in mind this tutorial is not going to show you how to bypass the password if you're not able to get into your Windows computer. That is a completely different subject and I have made tutorials like that in the past. I figured I'd put that disclaimer right now, but I'm sure there are people that will just immediately assume that that's what this tutorial is about and will dislike it when it does not allow them to bypass the password screen because they cannot get into Windows at the moment. This is simply for people that are looking to restart their computer without needing to insert the password every time. And assuming you're here for that reason, you are at the right place. So we're going to start by right clicking on the start button. And then you want to left click on run from the context menu that appears. Now you want to type in N-E-T-P-L-W-I-Z. And then you can either hit enter on your keyboard or left click on the OK button. Once you've done that, there should be a button that says users must enter a username and password to use this computer. Uncheck this box to turn that off. And once you've done that, that means you will not need to enter a username and password when you log into this computer. It's especially useful if you only have one user account. And then you just click on apply. You have to insert your password here at this time. Once you've done that and you've inserted the correct password, you can click on OK. And now if you restart your computer, it would automatically boot into Windows. Now you may be wondering to yourself if you automatically log into this one account but you have another account on this computer, how would you be able to access that one? And it's very simple. All you would do is right click on the start button, left click on the shutdown or sign out button, and then left click on sign out. Again you can do this with the option that we disabled on so you don't actually need to be able to log into the account so you don't have to even do what we did in this tutorial. And then you can see if we remove the upper blinds of the lock screen, we'd have the ability to log into other accounts if they were on this computer. However, this is a single user computer, that's why we do not have anything listed here. But if there were, you'd be able to just click on the icon and then you just would log in like normal. And you'll always need to insert a password if you sign out of your username. But generally, if you ever turn your computer off entirely and then turn it back on, or if you sleep your computer, you should not have to deal with that issue. So definitely nice to know. And I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.